if you ride with me I got a word for the both of us I'll put you in the driver's seat Don't gotta hurry in the middle of love When you ride with me Gotta worry when tomorrow comes I'll put you in the driver's seat Don't gotta hurry now Cause we stay in control in the name of love But if you can't see me now, I'm sorry. But then, um, I just came from my aunt's. I did her makeup, and so now we are at the service station. I'm on my way to work. Consent form. Thank you. <laughs> Sir, you can go in. First door on your right. Did doctor explain to you what he did? Yeah. Okay. This is thousand dollar. One thousand one fifty. What? This is thousand dollar. Yeah. Plus consultation is one fifty. Consultation. This is consultation. Ask doctor. This consultation. You can go to this. What is this one? For what? Um, I'm not sure. You can ask doctor. I think one is a mouthwash. One is probably for pain. I'm not sure what the other one is. You can ask him. Oh, the mouthwash. Oh. Yeah. There is a mouthwash and then there is, I think, one for pain, but the first one I'm not sure, so you can ask doctor. The pain I have. Oh, you pain? You have? I have the pain, yes, Okay. Yeah. But ask him and make sure.
So what happens is you come for consultation or she comes for consultation which is 150 rupees. Mm -hmm. The doctor mm -hmm. basically cleans her mouth and checks it out mm -hmm. for any other thing like cavity or feeling or whatever. Mm -hmm. And then the orthodontist is the one that takes the measurements. Mm -hmm. After taking the measurements, we'll be able to tell you how much it is. He doesn't give us prices at all. Yeah. Yes, numbers. Hi, how are you? Okay. 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 Six hundred rupees. Yes. One zero. Yes. If I fall, mm. then it's times four. Mm. No. That's whitening. Cleaning is eight hundred. Eight hundred. Yes. To clean. Six hundred. Look at Um, so I just got home. If you are hacking, if you are shaking it, eh? I don't know why. You should put the powder. It's in a in it's 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 a black thing. There's a blue. It's a black lid with blue words. Yes. So look at your girl. Uh, look at your girl. She did her own makeup. I'm like proud. I'm really proud. This is what your second, third time doing your makeup. Yeah. For, yeah. Anyway. Um, yeah, she had minimal products to use because I had to go to my aunt's makeup in the morning, as you guys saw. Yeah, and so she wants to do a tra transition for TikTok. Is it TikTok? Yes. Yes. And she's like, she she looks like. Can you look look in the mirror? Decent. <laughs> Literally. Can you not? Because you put it under your eye nail like yes. What are you using? Don't use that brush. Use the flat brush. Do you know me? This girl left me with like eyeshadow palettes. Right? Stop because the thing is hacking. Okay, sorry. You, this girl left me with eyeshadow palettes. And then with one foundation. This pro, pro, pro. Okay, I'll do this now. Quickly just gonna. This black, black opal professional foundation. This one. This is the. There are only two foundation that she owns that work on my skin, right? There are four. There are two that I can use. You can use this one. No, that I mastered on how oh, to use. Okay. There are, actually there are three. I'm lying it's through. There are three. This it's this one, and this one that she finished. You finished it. And then the other one, that, that's like in a blacky. Move, move out your chin. By the way, she's on the finish that Hannah Nagula foundation and she always says Hannah Nagula foundation. I'm on that Well, she loves it, so. I love Hannah Nagula. It's a very, it's a very um, compact foundation because it, it has full coverage with less oil to it. Like, it, it, it's oil-based base, but then, like, once you blend everything in, it literally just sinks in, sinks in your, your pores. And when I say that, don't get alarmed and think, Okay, so now they start getting pimples. No, just try it. Try it. It's two fifty per 
what do you call it pod okay and then so was that and then eyelash glue with no lashes okay i zulat for these lashes i went to the pits of the pits to find them i wasn't even gonna put on lashes now because but i was like you know what i think they would add volume to like the makeup because I, I was going for like a simple minimal look except for the blush i just felt like my face needed some color i needed to look alive and then my lip gloss or my lip uh, combo was really like a dark purple that i removed because i felt like that was doing too much and then i went with this nude maroonish i don't know vibe but yeah no setting spray nothing it was just concealer foundation and a bunch of eyeshadow this blush here is eyeshadow i used eyeshadow for blush am i not creative am i not artistic because if you tell me i'm not you're lying because i'm a nail artist can you move so. your thing away from your face and up up please um, if you tell me i'm not artistic you are a liar because i'm a nail artist what flavors? I is have it? to be artistic. She does. She has <laughs> choice. What flavor is what? The yes. pizza. Mm -hmm. It's a uh, supreme. Something, something, something. Mm. Forgot what it was called. But it has it. It has like corn. I don't um, like the corn, but I like it. You like the pizza. I like the pizza. I don't like the corn. It's really nice when it's warm because it's like a bit hot. Mm. It's just a little bit hot. Yeah, guys, that's my afternoon. I, I don't want to go like this on on YouTube. But I look pretty well. You look really good. I hope you also show them like. Oh, I also. Do you know what I did? So I also put like concealer in the middle here, ne? and then instead of like instead of like doing that thing that you do, right? You know the thing that you do with the with the contour. Was mm -hmm. it contour? Mm -hmm. That that dark thing you do. I used this other pencil you should use this pencil really to save your life you once told me right can i try doing highlighting without making shiny i know but then the shine that you use is from the palette mm. so this actually can, can you see the shine mm. you it's the same thing i know but this this does not show the that that darkness that i don't like the darkness is to end somebody somebody's did you see Andy and the Angela's pictures on Bella status? Like I didn't see like close ones. So the pictures the other okay I'll show you I'll show you when they when she took pictures close up name. Here's my thing. The other um makeup channel is I did name. I'm trying to get yeah. The other channel is makeup uh, um, looks I did name. I didn't put the powder that you're gonna put on now on the contour yeah? I only used to put it on the highlight mm. so what it does is that if you don't put it on the contour it doesn't fade out the blend you know most when you're like coloring something and you sharpen you know, you know when you're lip lining and then you, you you mix it up right and then you put a lighter color once you mix everything up it enhances um, the color that is underneath but blends it then it looks like it's airbrush like the lip combo so that's now the thing that I was doing. I wasn't putting the powder on the contour. Okay. I'm just saying. Oh, try to mix like the the light concealer with the darker concealer, and then you blend it out, and then you use this in the middle and see how it how it looks like. I try to do today. I'm I'm learning as I go. I know. So am I. So are we. Okay, I'm done. I just want this here This one is black. Yeah, this one is black. I'm eating this pizza. I'm gonna take pictures of the pizza so I can put it part of the thumbnail. But this is what it looks like. So the girlies bought pizza, right? And then I ate the one slice as you guys saw. So this is what is left over. So this is basically what it looks like. It has like corn, sausage, or meat. What is this? Yeah, um, it looks like bacon. I don't think it's bacon. I think it's sausage and then it has like um, chicken in it.
Good morning. Today is Sunday. Um, yesterday I just braided them and put flexi rods at the end. That's why they are, you know, cute and quite looking. So let's get to church. Let's get going to church. Um, I'm gonna show you guys my fit in a few minutes. I just wanna quick check if everything that I wanted to do for this look is done. I can't find my little earrings, my small earrings. Um, I'm so sorry, but yeah. I can't find my, my small earrings, so I'm thinking of these, right? Okay, so I just lowered you guys a bit. I don't know, I don't know. If she's in the mood, if the tripod is in the mood, but yeah anyway i think i'm just gonna put on these earrings and call it a day because yeah if i find the others i'm definitely gonna give you guys an update but for, for some weird reason i feel like my sister has them because she was asking about them so i'm gonna check it out and then i just quickly want to see how it looks like with the one Like I'm looking myself in the mirror, I can see, but it's just like I'm gonna look for the others. Anyway, my time is like, like I'm late. Okay, I'm late, so I'm gonna get going. I'm gonna show you guys the fit and then get going. Okay, I hope y'all can see me. Like, I don't know. I hope y'all can see me. But this is the fit. These are the shoes. I'm pretty late, so let's go. How amazing it is to be in the house of the Lord and be blessed with such powerful sermon. Absolutely. Joining in church as a community is so important as we learn to realign our lives and intentions while we do life together. Join one of our homes this week, invite you all and let's start off this year strong. I'm very sorry but um, I just I came to work I came like a while ago um, after church I just came to work we don't really work or I don't work on Sundays but you know I can just show up and then do bookings for the week if any patient comes in and they want to make a booking for the week and I'm here it's totally fine but today um, I basically have a date right like a, a girl's date and so I figured ugh, I can just stop by work instead of going all the way home and then having to come back for this date so I came here came to charge my phone um, and eat because I'm so hungry and eat um, I remember that I left bread what was that? I left bread I think it was someone on the roof I left bread in the fridge yesterday just in case like I'm hungry or my colleague is hungry but we'd not get the chance to buy lunch so yeah um, the sermon that we had today or the the word that was delivered to us it really just sunk deep the pastor was saying that there is no way that God is gonna agree with you when you talk down to yourself or when you say bad things about yourself to yourself or when you like like when you when you're just being critical to yourself or about yourself with yourself there is no way he's gonna agree with you what he does is he takes parts of you sometimes and then other times at times he takes 
the whole entire you shows you what he has created and why he disagrees with what you've just said so we are out here like saying things like oh i'm ugly or oh um, i'm not good enough or you know oh i'm not equipped for this i do not have enough tools within me to do a certain task or i, I can never achieve this certain thing or i can i can never get married or i can never bear children you know all these things that that seem so factual but isn't right and then you say these things to yourself and remember whatever you pour onto yourself is what you um what you portray that's what, that's what you're walking in this world as because that's what you're pouring into yourself and so to him it's like you are saying these things about me because i am you i i am a pure representation of who you are so whatever you feel yourself with is what is going to be represented in the world and so you're saying these things about me but that is not true because look at me and this is who i am watch what you guys say about yourselves to yourselves okay or who whoever like watch about what watch what you say about yourself to other people because as much as you are criticizing yourself and complaining about yourself to somebody else they may not be able to be like okay um that's not true you know but jesus does that god does that he will be able to tell you that is not true and it's in the bible it is in the bible because we are made in his image and who are we let's start there who are we to say we're not good enough who are we to say we're not equipped who are we to say we can't go there we can't travel to whatever we can't speak to whoever we are not confident enough who are we the audacity because we are made in his image and he has audacity he created a whole planet earth heaven he created that who are we to decide that we cannot when he has proven time and time again that we can that sunk that that's all i'm going to say that that song and i just wanted to show you guys to, to share that with you guys um while i sit here and charge my phone i've always just made sure to um have a positive outlook on life whatever i'm going through i've always made, tried to make sure that okay there is a reason there is a reason there is a reason for why this is happening how it happened and, and, and when it's happening there is a reason i've always tried to maintain that positivity but one thing i never done is link justifications to the to the reasonings and stuff like that so that i can better understand what god is trying to tell me or, or, or why i'm headed down that road it, it it has always just been a thing of okay well there's a reason to that and then just accept that and leave it at the surface i've never really dig down to find out okay but this is why but what does it mean you know i've never i was never like what does it mean you know like and so that was like my what what it means that was like oh that's what it means type of um realization um so it it i have so many new questions i definitely am going to be asking god when i go into prayer tonight um about just the just few things really i like to leave him alone i don't like to like and not a thing of like i can't ask him questions but i can't go to him and when i have questions it's just a thing of like I, I i will come back with another question random question to bother your brain that's just my mind but yeah i have a lot of like questions that i have like so i'm so curious right now um but the message is don't say something about you that isn't true that is not factual just because it feels that way and it's not written that way that means it's not factual so don't say things about yourself that isn't true because god is going to humble you and he is going to make you out to be a liar because that is not who he is okay read the bible find out who he is and remember that you are made in his image so whoever he is is what you are uh, also don't get cocky excuse my language don't get big headed and be like oh i can also create heaven and earth that's not what it means okay he's just trying to tell you that you are great you can be great i have made you great you need to believe it to access those fruits to live the life that i have written out for you 
the purpose that I have given you. You need to believe first that you can be and you are all those things, right? And maybe that's the problem that we don't believe. We say all these things, but we don't truly believe, like really, really believe, like have radical acceptance of things and truly believe these things that we preach or not preach, but say or um, when it comes to um, accepting who we are in in the the image of Christ or yeah or God, in God's image or you know um, yeah so it, there's a lot to it you can dissect it and um, unpack it however you like um, I hope you guys had a really good Sunday um, I'm gonna close up soon I'm just waiting for my friend um, and then I don't know if my phone is fully charged by the time she gets here I'll definitely vlog whatever else we do so Seriously, seriously, sir, sir, seriously. Look, this one blocking my view. The guy. Oh, happy New Year. We've not, we're not together much for the New Year. Why then be? Happy, happy New Year. <laughs> Are you guys doing game? That's a nice tent. It's very nice. Eh? It. Should we go check it out? I'm sorry, I'm going to check my tent. Where is that? Where is that of the tent? Where is that tent? Wow. Is there space? Yep. On top of your fingers? I had like an animal kingdom of some, some sort. Like it was never there. Animals, there's like the big five. I hated this. <laughs> I hated this. This thing. Every. Koskole. Gamams, every child used to throw this thing at and imagine Mohit in you know, like the entryway and then somebody's just hiding and then just boom and I'm just like and I hate snakes already. I would be traumatized. I think I still am traumatized. <laughs> Look why why are they so many? Ugh. Oh my thing. I'm so sorry if you guys hate snakes, but look. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you can put the USB in here, bro. That's crazy. And an aux cable. Oh my gosh. Wow. <laughs> why, why have stress when you can buy a child this and leave them alone? <laughs> and they don't bother you. You know, you just make sure you have a big yard so that they can yeah. tie themselves out. But Makui Marivari, it's money. I always wanted a skateboard, not gonna lie. I had a skateboard. It was never mine. Like I was never they never bought it for me. But you had but I had a skateboard somewhere somehow playing in the streets with other kids. I had roller skates and I fell from that thing like fifty times. Yeah. Your first smile. Oh 12 month photo, six oh. months. Oh, it's like a record book. Yeah. Guest book. Oh, everyone Ooh, that come visits okay. you at the hospital used to like write down their details. This is this is so nice. Oh, our first letter. Me it's Asari that are always sentimental. Because you can never give this these things so to some thoughtful. people. This is so thoughtful. This is so thoughtful. I want to check the content. It's very thoughtful. Why did you so thoughtful? This is the story of... Oh my goodness, this is even pretty. Oh, I definitely will be back. <laughs> These books are so therapeutic. Yeah, color is like with the, sp with the tiny little. These books oh. are. They don't have them in Ocho. Oh, Ocho, yeah. Rongo, I checked. I'm trying to do like a, like a sip and color with my friend. That's me and Guri literally just spoke about that. We were like, but for us it's puzzles. Okay. We're gonna buy like the thousand dollar puzzles. Yeah. Like the thousand pieces puzzles. Yeah. And then like with wine. Yeah. Oh wow! I think I should do that because she's been really down man lately. So I want to do a sip and, like a sip and, pay, sip and color. Yeah, we never made it to the end. But I always used to me. 
Have you? <laughs> do you guys know where to buy the thirty second Bible Bible version? Why is she repeating everything that I'm saying? I'm looking for the exact same thing. We checked in game. They only have a junior version and then the adult version. They don't have Bible. Yeah, because I'm also looking. For But then, why did you create it in the first place? for the movie yes this is how i look like before the movie <laughs> so we'll see how i look like after the movie <laughs> One destiny. <gasps> Regardless guys, it was nice.